and my name is Justin Riddell. I'm from Calvary Chapel of Philadelphia. I have been coming to the camp at Old Mill since after my sophomore year of high school. That puts this year, I think, at number 15 that I've been coming out. I come back because it's great. I love it. It's been a ministry I've been involved in since high school. I participate in. I take vacation time from work so I can come out here and spend time with the kids. To me, it's really rewarding because they just live in such darkness. And when you drive through the city and see the crime statistics and how many people live without two parent homes and all the churches that really don't have the attendance issues that they could in the town. There's a bunch of churches, but none of them really are doing anything. It's just such a sad town. And for you to be able to come out here and just push a kid on a swing or give them a piggyback ride and to see just the joy in their face and the laughter, to me it's an easy ministry because it doesn't take that much. All you have to do is love on them. You don't need to be skilled in different languages or traveling across the world. I mean, I think I live 54 miles away from driveway to driveway. And I come out on Thursday afternoon for an hour and again, all you do is push a kid on the swing or throw a basketball back to him when it comes out of bounds. And yet, it makes a difference. They remember your name year after year. And for us to be able to just be a light in the darkness of this place, to me, just says it all. Everything's a blast to me. I mean, I spent multiple hours in the cold creek today just pulling people off the rope swing and pushing them back towards the ladder so that they get to swing back in. Grabbing people off the slide and pushing them back to the ladder so they can run down and do it again. I mean, it's not that hard just to stand there and be cold for two hours and throw kids around and make sure they don't drown. So to be used of the Lord with something as simple as that, to me, just makes all the difference. So a lot of the kids now are just fantastic because they've been coming for years and all their older siblings and cousins have come. You get the few that are a little more of a handful, but to me it's a blast. I mean, you're planting the seed. The seed has been planted in all these kids' lives, and I come back year after year and Thursday after Thursday just to continue to water that seed. And if I can water that seed and the Lord could use it and bless the faithfulness that I have coming out here, well, that's all I can say. I mean, I can give a couple bucks so that the Bridge Academy can feed these kids and help them with homework, just another plus. I mean, to me, it's been a blast. You got kids that come out and are disrespectful and run around and don't listen to anything, but at the end of the week when you see them hugging their counselor because they don't want to leave, it shows that we're making a difference. Even though you thought you weren't getting through to them the entire week, to me it's fantastic. And that's why I come back year after year. It's just, they remember your name, they remember the songs you did a year ago, they learn Bible verses every day or over the course of the week, and you know you're planting God's seed in their heart. And I mean, it won't return void. So, to me, that's the reason I come. That's why I love it. And I continue to plan on this being a mission that I'm involved in for the next however many years. So, thanks.